How does a cell make another cell? It does it by a process called mitosis. Mitosis is an asexual reproduction where a single cell divides into two identical cells. However, not all soma or body cells undergo mitosis at the same rate and some don't even reproduce ever again. As an example, skin, blood forming cells, and intestinal cells reproduce constantly, whereas muscle cells are every few years, except for the cardiac or heart muscle. The cardia muscle will not reproduce once it's damaged. And like the heart, the brain and spinal nerve cells don't reproduce once they have been damaged or destroyed either. Now that's something to think about, especially when it comes to taking care of yourself. So, we're going to look at the process of mitosis as a play. First, let's look at the cast members. The nucleus, chromatin, chromosomes, chromatids, centrioles, centrosome, spindle fibers, centromeres, cytoplasm, and last but not least, the two new identical cells. The rest of the organelles, including the nucleus, disappear during cell division. Before we get started, here's a little backstory to catch you up to speed. The nucleus, which is the brain of the cell, has already initiated the process. Prior to the actual cell division, the nucleus has commanded the chromatin material, or DNA, to condense and organize itself into chromosomes. 46 of them to be exact. Now that we're ready, we'll begin with the actual cell division process called mitosis. To see the rest of this video and many more, please visit us at ctskills.com.